He's in need of evac at the bridge. Scorpion, no evac units are in your immediate area. Secure the bridge control room and sit tight. Secure the bridge? What the hell with? There's only two of us left. Do the best you can, Scorpion. An evac unit is en route. HQ out. And on that note, hey everybody, welcome back to Quake 4. I'm your host, Willie B. Coyote. In the last video, I rode several elevators. Here's an instant replay. Diva tantrum. Check. Elevator music. Check. Before we continue, let's get the self-promotion done right out of the gate. Be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. It helps you grow and hopefully get paid as well. Also, make sure to hit the notification icon on your way out so you never miss an upload. And without further ado, let's get into it. Oh, one more thing before we get started. Uh, I'm now currently sitting, at the time of recording, I'm currently sitting at 46 subscribers. So smash that subscribe button so we can get up to 50 and I can uh, start up the Max Payne Let's Play. So, uh... Let's begin, shall we? Okay. Oh. We are in the deep dark now. This is, uh, very ominous looking. Oh, frick. Frickin' berserkers are what? What? It, I'm not sure. Uh, is that the berserker? I'm not sure. I can't remember any of the, uh, <laughs> uh, enemy archetype names in Quake, unfortunately. But that's mostly just a skill issue on my part. Skill issue. Ah, I love the Quake 4 shotgun. It is so much... Like, I said it at the beginning of the Let's Play that the Quake 4 shotgun is way better than the Doom 3 shotgun. At least in terms of vanilla, anyway. Because in the uh, Doom 3 Halo conversion mod I've been doing a Let's Play of on this channel, concurrently with this Quake 4 Let's Play, um... The uh, mod author, Valkyrie, shout out by the way, uh, he uh, obviously he modified the code of the shotgun so uh, so it actually, you know, works. <laughs> yeah. The uh, vanilla Doom 3 shotgun is not good. Up. Copy that. Let's see if we could try and raise the bridge then. Oh, incoming! Oh, I'm really low on health right now. Hey, give me a boost, will ya? I swear, if I die this early in the video, you know what? Screw it. Freedom! Oh no, wait. I'm still alive. <laughs> well, that was anticlimactic. Okay. And there's health here. Thank, thank God for that. Okay. Um, through here. Back here. You there. Here, I scavenged this off a dead strong. It'll make your lightning gun damage multiple targets. Give it a try. Okay. Hit it. All right, let's give this new and improved lightning gun a try. Interactivate. Ah, there's a health station back here. That's handy. So, uh... Yeah, I'm really looking forward to doing the Max Payne Let's Play on this channel. Like, uh, I've never played Max Payne. You know, I've said this before, so I'll just say it again. I've never played Max Payne before, and I'm really excited to... Copy that. Um, so we have to go down this... Go up this way to, uh extend the bridge and there's a uh, I think these might be the berserkers but I'm not sure tell you what comment down below which which 
enemy archetypes are which, so I don't make myself look like any more of a noob than I already have. Okay. Interactivate. And up comes the bridge. That works. Going down. Yeah, fix up my armor, will you? Thank you. Okay. Interactivate. Yes, I am going to keep saying interactivate because it's funny. Come at me, bro. Yeah. I'm uh planning on doing a DRG video. Uh, that's a video on Deep Rock Galactic pretty soon because uh, season five just dropped. So I'm probably gonna drop in, maybe invite some buddies to play with me, and uh, and uh, maybe even do a collab with some guys I know. So uh, that could be fun. So stay tuned for that. Okay. Which way are we going now? Um, I think maybe down here. Up. I keep hitting the control because I'm so used to control being the uh, being the crouch button that I keep forgetting that Quake Four it's bound to alternate fire. Like this isn't me hitting the mouse button. This is me hitting control right now. And C is how you crouch. I'll probably end up changing it at some point, but you know. Or I might not because I'm lazy like that, you know? Don't freaking kill me now, please. Thank you. Over here. Up. Check this area if there's any health. Because I'm low on health and armor. Ammo. Back here, no. That just leaves this door. Yeah. And wherever there's enemies, that means you're going the right way. Yeah. Yep. All right. Here. Oh, great. I almost okay. friendly fired there. You're hey, Cortez. I did not shoot you when I first had that strong face of yours in my crosshairs. But then, had I killed you, I would have lost the bed with Rhodes. And that would not do. Mm -hmm. I am on my way to the processing tower. Why don't you accompany me? But before we can proceed, this tram must be rotated in the proper direction. All right, let's align the tram car then, shall we? Okay, uh, we've got to, uh, so, I'll follow, uh, Cortez then, I guess, through Leave here. Away and let us see if we can find the hot control room. Yeah, oh, we got incoming! That might have been the first time there I tactically used a, uh, exploding barrel. Oh boy, big guy, big guy, big guy. No, I don't want to get cornered. Thank you. This is my boomstick. This is my boomstick. Expand. Get this bridge up. Charge! No, wait, no, wait, not quite. Charge! Reload. Okay, through here. Which one's the nail gun? There it is. Ammo. 
I'm not picking up clips, by the way. They're actually called magazines, but, uh, you know, video games aren't exactly the most accurate when it comes to firearms anyway. Thanks, Captain Obvious. Die, please. Thank you. Ah, health station. Thank you. Is there anything over here? No. Alright. So here. Excellent. This looks to be the hub control room. See if you can find some way to rotate the tram from here. Okay, uh... There we go. We've aligned the tram car correctly. The tram is now facing the right direction. But it appears the track is damaged. Perhaps we can use some of the stroke repair bots to fix the track. There is a door leading to a construction site below the track. You may be able to acquire some repair bots there. I will remain here and guard the track. Copy that. Alright, uh, we're on our own again. Check every nook and cranny. That's what she said! <laughs> and onward and downward. Wait, did I... Was I going the right way, or... I can't remember. Um... Ah, construction. I'm gonna follow the sign. Construction... this way, I think. If I get a sa game save prompt, I'll know that I'm going the right way. What the hell was that? giving me armor shards. I, I don't trust that. I'm gonna switch to the boomstick here. Always make sure your shotgun's well loaded. That's a handy bit to know there. Oh boy. Lights are out. Something in here. Health and armor. Not that way. Not that way. Okay, what, which way do I have to go now? Don't think this might. And I can't go back the way I came either, so I've definitely gotta. Yes, thank you for that. And thank you for opening the door, dingus! go. Weird strog dog thing. <laughs> strog dog, that rhymes. Moving on. So yeah, uh, the, uh, also the, uh, Summer Games Fest was this past week, weekend, and, uh, I gotta say, the, uh, Xbox Showcase was without doubt the best one of the bunch, and I'm, like, like, I'm not a console warrior fanboy by any means, like I used to be until I realized how stupid the whole thing was. Like, uh, like, honestly, like, console warrior fanboys are just, like, the most irritating human beings on the face of the planet. They just are not, like, they are just not intelligent, like, and especially the Sony Pony fanboys, which are the PlayStation fanboys, they are the worst of the bunch, like... Okay. What was I supposed to do here? Ah, here we are. Anyways, um... Uh, console warrior fanboys generally tend to be really annoying, but Sony fanboys, that is... or Sony Ponies, as we like to call them, for the uninitiated who are watching, uh... They are by far the worst of the bunch. Like, they just are the most unintelligent human beings on the face of the planet. Like, console warrior fanboys will bend themselves into pretzels to say, justify why their console is allegedly the best. But, like, it's pretty much just... It really just all comes... When, at the end of the day, it all just comes down to personal preference. Like, uh... Like, as a console to play, the PlayStation and the Xbox are not any better than the other one. But... Like, uh... 
like they're both good consoles and they both accomplish everything they set out to do and they do it very well uh, but like these console warrior fanboys will like bend themselves into pretzels trying to explain why theirs is the best and everyone else is a shill and blah 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 it's just so stupid it's so stupid it's really just personal preference at the end of the day But anyways, Xbox by far had the best showcase of the bunch, and with, like, I think the most promising lineup of games of any of the, of the various, uh, studios that are up right now. Um, and I think I might have just gotten lost accidentally. <laughs> so, uh, I'm gonna be right back with the power of editing once I found my way. now back to your regularly scheduled program and we're back I think I might have finally gotten to where I need to be let's see let's crouch so I don't get crushed accidentally there we go and voila yay we're up and we're voila. Right, so. okay you got some health and armor so anyways for the Xbox lineup of games that's coming uh, within the next year or so you know, Perfect Dark is coming back, so that's cool, and that looks really good. Uh, almost lost all my hearth, health and armor there. <laughs> like, an absolute noob. Hairbot controls. Check for uh, health and armor. Check every nook and cranny, that's what she said. Alright. Hairbots are fixing the, uh, the, uh, track there, and we are all good to go. Excellent, King. The track has been repaired. Return to the tram and we can be on our way to the processing tower. Alright, let's roll. Through here. So, uh, Anyways, uh, about the showcase, uh, Perfect Dark looks pretty good. Um, Gears of War E-Day looks absolutely incredible. And here we go, next level in the line. Many months later. Alright, here we go, yet another Rails level. Oh, incoming! So, uh, this rails level... And this thing is really fragile. This tram is really fragile. Incoming! Come on, come on. Flyers, hold still! But yeah, Gears of War E-Day looks awesome. I'm so, so hyped for that game. Like, because I'm a huge, huge Gears of War fan. And like, just to see Marcus and Dom back together in, in, the, in a prequel to the original trilogy is just, that's going to be awesome. It's going to be so freaking awesome. Yeah, the only thing that saddens me about the... Xbox uh, showcase this year is that we're s we still haven't gotten anything Halo related, which is kind of understandable. And here we are, next level completed. 
And now back to your regularly scheduled program. So here we are now at the data processing terminal. Let's begin. Cortez, this is Morris. Are you and Kane at the processing tower yet? Yes, we have just arrived. Okay, drop off Kane. You're needed at the networking tower right away. Kane has to take care of the security station at the top of the processing tower. But I'd hope to stay with Kane. No can do, Alex. Sledge will be here soon enough to lend Kane a hand. Very well, Cortez out. I'm sorry, Kane, but I must go. Good luck to you, my friend. All right, let's roll. Through to here. Call the lift. Hey, this is Morris. Data processing towers shut down. Looks like the Strong are trying to stop us from reaching the core. You have to find a way to bring it back online. Sledge is on his way. He should rendezvous with you shortly. Come Copy up. that. Morris out. Going up, return power to the processing tower. Should be easy enough. How hard can it be? How hard can it be? Oh, how I've missed the pang of dread, I feel, whenever you mention the words, how hard can it be? Well okay. Got both bridges extended. Can't go that way, so I'll be going this way then. Through here. Incoming! Armor. Yes, that's helpful. Thank you. Strongified Marines, thank you for the ammo. Reloading. I need your ammo. Give me your ammo. Thank you. Through here. What have we got here, then? Ah, here we are. Activate power. Good job, King. The building's back online. All right. Let's head back the way we came, and, uh... Oh, for God's sake! I hate those things. Load. Copy that. If I don't die first, that is. Thank God for that spare health kit that I left there. God damn And now back to your regularly scheduled program. Kane, over here. Hey Sledge. Good to see you, Kane. I do not know if you can help, but the attack on the core has cost many lives. We must succeed so that they will not have died in vain. Let us find the security interface at the top of this tower. Lead the way. Copy that. Here's hoping there's some health behind this door. At the networking tower. This mission is going to get more technical, so I'm handing over communications to him. Good luck, guys. Get this mission done. All right. Morris, out. 
Greetings, this is Strauss. I have finally been able to hack into the Nexus. Soon I will know all there is to know about the tower you're in. Ah, here we are. The large machine oh. just entered That's our good. data pump. That's helpful. They move information from the networking tower to the storage tower. This is a health and ammo. Calls so lift. How I hate to wait for elevators. Hmm. Looks like we gotta wait a little bit. I bet for sure we're not gonna have to hold this position while we wait! It's false. No way. Not this time. We created it. Not this time. No. Not this time. It's totally made up. Pure fiction. Die! 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 Funny thing about these strong teleporters is that it's really easy to just, like, spawn camp them, basically. Which is a perfectly viable strategy on the lower difficulties. And another giant spider thing. Looks like the elevator might be here. And there we go. Going up. Well, that was certainly entertaining. Yes, indeed it was. Indeed it was. Two thousand years later. Now here we are in data processing security. This is looking really, really ominous. This is like some alien resurrection shit here. Wait, hold on. Floor nineteen hundred seventy-eight. What? What did he say? How many floors are there in this damn building? What are those devices on the ceiling? They are information routers, but they appear to be out of alignment. Kane should be able to use the consoles to correct this problem. Okay. Now we've got to fire up the consoles again. I want to try and use the lightning gun for a little bit. Please let there be some health around the corner. Please, please, please. Oh, well, that's just great. And now back to your regularly scheduled program. Loading. Okay, what do we do here? Call lift. And down we go. Oh, uh, what to now?
All right. Things aren't going well for those guys. Um. Very well done. Kate. There we go. Let's go. Lights are on. Through here, I assume. Ah! Yeah. The hell kind of noise was that I just made? That's what she said. <laughs> oh well. I'm no Strauss, but I believe that router is also damaged. Yeah. Let's uh, see if we can find a way to fix it. Open seal. Great, more teleporting uh, strong ladies here. Okay, so uh, this is going to be a real big puzzle here. So I'm going to have to route this around to here. Uh, how hard can it be? How hard can it be? Don't say that! First, I actually got to find the control unit to route this shit. Where? Yeah, this could take me a while. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Okay, I'm back and I found it. I've got to take this elevator up to uh, go to the next interface. And, uh... And, uh, science this shit. Alright. Here we go. Okay... And should be well. That seems to have done the trick. And onward we go. Yeah, I get the feeling we're going to have to bring that down. After we kill these assholes. There we go. Let's fucking go. here. Big guy, take him down. Through here, I think. After we kill these things. Okay, lower this, realign the data nodes. Awesome. And we've got an extension for the bridge. Uh, now we go through here, I think. Oh boy.
Did I just destroy the teleporters? I did not know I could do that. If I'd known I could do that, I would have done that a lot earlier in this video. But you know what? I'm a noob with skill issues, so what are you going to do? Continuing onwards, through here, and through here. There we go, going up. And here we are. Wait, no, we're not. We're going over this way now. And through here. Through here. That must be all that remains of the squad. Ouch. They are in not good shape. Let's head through here. Here. Now we're going up once again. All the way to the tippy top. There we are. Commander there. He's down. Big guy. He's down. Finally. Activate. That's two down, one more to go. That's uh, two down and one more to go. And I think that's pretty much a good a spot as any to end this video. Um, thanks a lot for everybody for watching and tuning in. Um, I really have a lot of fun playing these games and I'm now at 46 subscribers. So be sure to smash that subscribe button if you're new here uh, and help me get up to 50 subscribers. Thanks so much to everybody for tuning in this week. Be sure to come back next week. I've been Willie B. Coyote, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!